I think you have to, in some ways, the the balancing act that the Flames are playing with with their goaltending situation is you want to give Wolf the opportunity as much as you can, but you do have a relationship with Jacob Marks from which um, is pro- okay. Let's face it. I mean, speaking of spoiler previews here, the uh, the off season end of end of season garbage bag day. The most interesting interview is going to be Jacob Markstrom without question. And so that relationship between Markstrom and the flames going forward is going to be important, whatever happens. So, um, and we do know that Markstrom was already upset, already expressed his feelings once. So I think that they're trying to navigate Markstrom's happiness with Dustin Wolf's needing play. Do you think that the fact that the flames are playing Markstrom continually, um, says something about their desire to keep him. I think that the Flames can be, you know, I again, I'll, I'll reiterate this, and I think we, you and I are probably on the unpopular side of the Flames track on this. I think the right move for the Flames was not training Markstrom to the New Jersey Devils back in February because of the salary, the, not, the salary retention issue. And I still think that you can get you still have a number of options in the off season for him. I, if they don't get the right trade for Markstrom, they don't have to do that in the off season. They can wait until the start of the year to, to make that happen. They don't, I don't know if Markstrom holds as much of the cards as people think. I think the flames hold a pretty good deck in this as well, where you can, okay, look, you can kind of say, say okay i'm gonna go to these teams okay we're still gonna try to do our best to get the best out of that even though it's not you know and i think there's going to be more teams involved in this conversation and i'm not necessarily convinced that markstrom is going to hold the flames hostage um because i'll throw another team that i think entered the markstrom chat if the colorado avalanche are out in the first round of the playoffs again this year i think they have to take a long look at oh, i think they and i think they would take a big swing yeah yeah Kevin, the reason I ask that is like if you have sort of resigned yourself that Markstrom's not going to be a flame come the start of next season, why do you really care about playing him and keeping him happy, right? If you've kind of already – he's got one foot out the door. So it makes me wonder if the Flames and Markstrom have had a chat or you know they have some knowledge that we don't that, hey, we think this guy's going to be around long term, so we need to kind of keep him as our number one. Mm-hmm. 